Hey guys, so today I'm going to do my rereadathon TBR video, which it started today and I've already started reading, but I hadn't put up a TBR video yet because I've been really busy with work and stuff lately, so I just haven't had time to like do it, but I'm doing it now and um, yeah, so let's just get into it. There are challenges, but I'm not really going by the challenges because like I don't have a book that to reread a book to give it a second chance because if I really don't like a book I will put it down like the wrath and the dawn I got like 170 pages in or something like that and I was just like I can't do it anymore I'm fucking bored nope so and then books that I and then other and books that I have finished like they're really good so it's not like I'm giving them a second chance because I already like them so I don't have one for that one um, so, yeah, and then the rest of them can kind of go for any of the challenges, so, but I'll kind of tell you, uh, whatever, we're just going to get into this. Um, the first challenge is, like, reread a childhood favorite, and I guess, um, Midnight for Charlie Bone could count for that. This, I read back in, like, fifth grade, sixth grade, I don't know, somewhere around in there, and I remember I just, I loved this so much. I love the entire series. I think, but I only got up to like book five and there's like eight and so I only got up to book five which I've been slowly collecting these I'm still missing the third and the seventh and eighth I think but I have the rest of them um, and I think I can get the other three that I'm missing from book uh, thrift books so I'll probably do that at some point when I have money but for now I do have the first and the second one so I think I'm gonna go ahead and just reread the first one because like I said it has been a very 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 long time since I read this book and th it's a really quick read like the font is huge and it's like this so I think it'll be easy to reread um so yeah that will be that one um reread a book you gave five stars literally all of these all of these could count for that challenge because I gave every single one of these five stars so there's that um, <laughs> reread a book to give it a second chance, like I said, I don't have one for that. Reread a book from a series, this and, this and Charlie Bone count for it, for that challenge, and then read at least three books, which I'm planning on reading five, so, there you go. But I'll go into the ones that I'm rereading without doing that. Um, so Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix, and as you can see, I'm already... I already started this today, and I am on page 59. I'm on chapter 4, number 12, Grim Grimwald Place. So that's where I'm at in this book. Um, I reread Goblet of Fire, like, last, not last month. I think it was the month before that I reread Goblet of Fire. I've been rereading the Harry Potter series throughout this year, and um, now I'm on Order of the Phoenix, and the reread fun came around, and I was like, well, that's perfect timing, because I'll just read this during that. Um, so probably I'm going to be reading the other books in between reading this. I'll probably read, like, try to read 150 pages a day or so of this and then read the other books. I don't know. I don't know how that's going to go, but I might just end up, like, plowing through this in, like, a day or two and then read the other books. I have no idea because I love Harry Potter, like, more than I love my life. So Harry Potter is everything. It's everything. And I really love this book. Like, I love this one so much. I think... It's my second favorite, because Prisoner of Azkaban is my all-time favorite, but I think this one is my second favorite, just because Sirius Black and Fred and George Weasley. The only re <laughs> those are literally my reasons every time I love a Harry Potter book more than the other ones, it's because there's a lot more Sirius Black and Fred and George Weasley in that book, and there's a lot of those characters in this one, a lot more than there is in the other books, so, yeah, that that's why. That's why. And then Deathly Hollows is okay, but, like, I don't like it. I love all the other books more than Deathly Hollows. Deathly Hollows is definitely my least favorite, and that's because we're not at Hogwarts, and it's sad, and I don't like that. Hogwarts is, like, my favorite thing, and, yeah. So. Um, and then another book that I'm gonna... I don't know if this one will happen. This one might be the one that doesn't happen. I'm not sure. Um, either this one's not gonna happen, or Midnight for Charlie Bone's not gonna happen, but I feel like Midnight for Charlie Bone's probably gonna happen, so this one might not happen. I'm hoping they all happen, but, like I said, we'll see. Um, 
That is Ready Player One by Ernest Klein. I read this back in like March or April of this year, I want to say, and it was so good. I just remember I loved it and like I was going out shopping with somebody and I was literally in the car just reading it while we were going on our way to all the places and stuff because I was so close to finishing it and I was so into it and I just could not put it down and I was, oh, I was loving this book. And because I'm a big video gamer, like, I love, 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 love this book. So, because it's got, it's got the whole video game thing in it, it feels very Sword Art Online-esque which I love, and so this is just a really fantastic book, and I would love to reread it because I just remember how much I love this story, and it's just so much fun, and it's so easy to read, and I just, I love it. I love it, love it, love it. So I'm hoping that I'll get to reread this because it was a lot of fun. And then the next two books go together that I want to reread, Fangirl and Carry On by Rainbow Rowell. Now, one of the main reasons I want to read, read these is, one, because they're fantastic, and two, because it will give me inspiration to keep writing the fan fiction that I've been writing for a while. Sorry, my cat was walking across the thing and he scared me. Um, and then the third reason is because I really want to do a book review for Carry On and like basically defending it because a lot of people talk trash about this book and it really makes me mad because this book is fucking fantastic. And so I really just, I want to reread it. That way I can just refresh myself with everything that way I can properly uh, defend it and everything so that's probably gonna happen pretty soon and I'm just so excited like these two are probably like other than like Harry Potter these are the two that I'm like most excited to reread so I can't wait I can't wait but they're just these books are just so much fun they're just legit so much fun and I just love it and I love 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 fan fiction like so much and these books just ha make my soul so happy so so yeah those are the five books I plan on rereading this week from the 6th to the 13th by the way that's when the readathon is so today is the 6th and I've already started Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix um I don't know if I'm gonna continue on with that today I might put it down and pick up Midnight for Charlie, Bone, or Fangirl. I'm not sure. I don't know. I want to read all these books. It's really frustrating because I want to read all of them. Um, but I'm kind of thinking I'm going to keep reading Harry Potter just until Sirius comes in because, like, Sirius, man. Sirius Black. Uh, I love Sirius Black so much with all my heart. Uh, and like I said, that one probably is, like, my second favorite book, but I fucking hate Dolores Umbridge. The fact that she's in that book really bugs me and it kind of brings it down, but Sirius and Fred and George make up for it. They just... Perfection. Perfection. Also, Peeves. Like, Peeves is fucking fantastic in this book. I love him. And McGonagall. McGonagall is also fantastic in the Everybody is fantastic in Order of the Phoenix except for Dolores. Let's just go with that, okay? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna stop talking about Harry Potter now because literally I'll be here all day if I just keep talking about Harry Potter. But that's my, uh, read a re read a thon TBR. Um... Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you're participating, let me know. Um, and thanks to um, Eva from Fred Weasley Died Laughing for making this thing a thing. Yeah, that was really annoying. Um, for making this readathon happening. Sorry, I'm just, I'm excited. I'm thinking about Harry Potter and I'm just like, ugh. Because, yeah. Anyway. I, this, these are the times, you guys. These are the times when I wish I edited my videos. Because then I would edit out all the stupid crap that I do. But I don't. I don't do the edits because I don't have the edit software. And because, I don't know, I feel like it's kind of fun to not edit. Because then you guys get to see all the stupid stuff I do. It's like the bloopers are just in there for all of you to enjoy. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. Rambling, rambling, gonna stop now. But yeah, so that's my TBR. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And, um, yeah, have fun if you're participating this week. And I hope you enjoy your rereads. If you're not participating, I hope you enjoy whatever you are reading. And how about that Skyrim Remastered, though? That's probably the reason I'm not gonna get all these th done, because. 
I got my copy yesterday in like Skyrim though. Skyrim. Okay, anyway. Yeah, I'm gonna go and try to read for a little bit more before I jump into some Skyrim today because that's one of my main things today because I'm off today, which is exciting, and basically I'm just gonna play Skyrim, like a bunch. Um, and then, but I'm gonna be at work tomorrow, so then I will be reading tomorrow. Um, oh, and I think I'm gonna be vlogging this, so that's something. Probably gonna be on my phone though because the last time I vlogged, on, I tried vlogging on my tablet, I never uploaded my vlogs, so gonna have to be done on my phone so sorry about that poor quality though but it's gonna be okay it's gonna be fun I'm excited about it um I can't vlog when I'm at work though but I'll update you guys before and after so yeah anyway that's all I got I keep saying that I'm about to go and then I just keep on adding stuff so I'm sorry this time I'm really going so I'll see you guys later have fun bye